With bonfire night just days away, motorists have been issued an important firework warning that could result in fines, penalty points and impact insurance. Also known as Guy Fox Night, the holiday sees people all over Scotland celebrate on November 5th with bright firework displays. However, it is illegal to transport a large amount of fireworks without the valid license or registration to do so. The advice comes thanks to Graham Conway, Managing Director of Select Car Leasing, who explained drivers caught carrying over 56 kilograms of the pyrotechnics could be slapped with a £300 fine, six points and invalidated insurance. As such, Anyone planning to do so are being advised to contact their insurance provider ahead of time to see if they are covered. Some motor insurers will cover customers who have bought fireworks for a personal display but even then, drivers need to take certain steps to stay safe. As reported by Nottinghamshire Post, he said, when transporting fireworks, it is extremely important to take safety precautions as they can be extremely dangerous if they were to ignite or combust. Firstly, you must ensure they do not become damp, as damp fireworks are more likely to leak explosive content, meaning they could behave differently when ignited. Before transporting fireworks, you must ensure they are not in close proximity to any combustible materials, as being stored with such items can cause them to easily catch fire. Items such as lighters, matches, electric fan heaters, smoking materials, or any electrical installations such as lights that are a risk to ignition should be kept separated and away from fireworks. Storage must also be considered and leaving them in your vehicle could have serious consequences. It is also important you do not leave fireworks in your car overnight, Conway added. If it rains or is a foggy night, the inside of the vehicle can become damp, making the fireworks more susceptible to becoming volatile and leaking explosive material. Fireworks should be clear of all combustible materials, and shouldn't be stored with items that will easily catch fire. Whilst transport cartons can be stored in the vehicle, they should be flattened out and completely empty. Not to mention, if your vehicle is involved in an accident, any sparks from an incident could also ignite fireworks. So ahead of bonfire night, if you do need to transport fireworks or even sparklers, in your vehicle, check with your insurance provider if you are covered for transferring such goods. Ensure you aren't carrying large amounts of goods, and take the right precautions to minimize the risk of accidental explosion. Join the Daily Records WhatsApp community here and get the latest news sent straight to your messages.